day everyone. My name is Denzel Celestin de Costa from the Department of Hospital Science, Milagros College, Mangalore. Today we are going to talk on the topic cuts of beef part 2. Today we are going to talk on the cut that is loin. Okay, now let's see the different steaks available in the loin. First one is the top loin steak. The beef loin top loin steak is the first type of steak cut from the beef loin. It is cut from the end of the beef loin which contains the last or 13th rib. Okay, let me repeat. It is cut from the last or 13th rib of an animal. This steak is identified by the large eye muscle. Okay, you can see in the picture there is one large muscle there. The rib bone and part of the backbone. You can see the backbone here as well as the rib bone here. Okay, so that is the top loin steak. Next one is the T-bone steak, which is a very famous steak that is there uh, in the markets. This the steak is has the characteristics of T. You can see here it has T in it. Okay, that is why it is known as a T-bone steak shape vertebra and the large eye muscle the smaller muscle located below the t bone is the tenderloin you can see a small muscle which is here that is a part of the tenderloin so you have one large eye muscle and a tenderloin muscle over there next top loin steak boneless you can see the steak which is a top loin steak which is deboned as you know we saw what is a top loin steak now boneless is another steak wherein the bones are very carefully removed and then the meat and the fat is retained in a proportion so that it can be grilled without the bone next one is porterhouse steak the porterhouse steak is similar to the beef loin t-bone steak okay however the tenderloin muscle is much larger you can see the tenderloin muscle which is larger over here okay and an extra muscle is located in the center here you can see a small extra muscle which is located in the center of the porterhouse steak on the upper side you can see this this is the extra muscle that is located this is the part of the uh, tenderloin steak okay and this is the normal round steak so this is the porterhouse steak yeah next we'll go to tenderloin steak as we tell this is the mercedes of your uh, steaks the most tender part of the cut the most tender retail cut from the entire beef carcass is the beef loin tenderloin steak this steak has a fine texture in a circular shape and is usually about three inches in diameter this this is this meat is which comes inside the ribs which is the most tender part of the meat okay that is the tenderloin steak we head on to the next uh, steak in the loin is sirloin steak the beef loin or sirloin steak pin bone is the first cut from the sirloin area of the beef loin the steak looks much like the beef loin t-bone and put house steak in that it contains the t-bone and large eye muscle and the tender tenderloin muscle however it also contains an oval shaped bone which can see in which can be seen in the upper left corner of the steak this bone is called the pin bone and is the tip portion of the hip bone you can see the uh, complexity in this steak here sirloin steak it is one of the one among the more uh, complex steaks that are there we head on to the next is sirloin steak flat bone the beef loin sirloin steak flat bone is the least valuable type of sirloin steak if both the flat hip and backbone are left on the steak you can see more bone is there in the steak than compared to any loin steaks okay next one is sirloin steak round bone you can see this round bone here okay so this is the sirloin which contains the entire sirloin and a round bone which is there which is the round bone sirloin steak the sirloin steak round bone is located further back on the sirloin area of the beef loin this particular sirloin steak has the greatest amount of lean and the least amount of bone on the steak now we head on to sirloin steak wedge bone as we can see in the image there is a small wedge bone in the steak okay when we elaborate on it the sirloin steak nearest okay 
the wholesale beef round is called as the beef loin sirloin steak wedge bone only one bone is usually seen a wedge shaped bone at the bottom of the cut near to the center you can see here a small wedge bone is seen here which is near to the center of the steak next one is sirloin steak boneless yes the sirloin steak boneless absolutely means there is no bone in it the beef loin sirloin steak boneless is an excellent steak for broiling and is made by removing all of the bones from any of the other type of sirloin steak okay so i presume you have understood all the steak cuts in the loin meat thank you one and all